Welcome back everybody. Uh, today I'm going to continue talking about the elephant ear plant and uh, more specifically I'm going to show you uh, how much to water it and also how to keep the soil, how to keep the water um, in the soil and keep the moisture levels up which can be a problem for plants like this. Um, so usually I water it with one of these every day. Uh, I live in Southern California so it gets a little bit hot and the soil can dry out. Um, so I water every day. Make sure not to get it on the inside of the plant. You just want to water the soil around it. And what I like to do to keep the moisture in is um, there's about two inches before you get down to the soil. Um, I put peat moss, a whole layer, like an inch of peat moss, and then I put a whole layer of uh, uh, bark or mulch on top of it, and so that keeps it all moist. These plants like to stay really, really, like almost wet, like swampy kind of wet, uh, and they do really well, so you can see that it's really thriving. I got a new little growth right there. Um, yeah, so you want to water this. You don't have to water it every day, but it's good to water it. You don't have to worry about overwatering it. If you just think about watering it, water it one day. Um, water it every day or every other day is good. And um, just one of these small little things should be fine. And um, if you notice that it's getting yellow or you're having trouble keeping the moisture in the, in the water, put a layer, put a one inch layer of peat moss and then put an, about another inch of mulch. And it'll keep everything nice and moist and the plant will be really happy.